After months of searching, the Little Rock School District is now one step closer to finding their newest leader. They decided on a final candidate during last night's special school board meeting. Our Katrin Asaf is live at the administration building now with who was the top pick and what he hopes to accomplish. Katrin? Well, Laura, Bob, his name is Dr. Jamal Wright, and he's basically done just for a couple more steps. They do have to go through contract negotiations, and then they also have to do additional background checks, and then he should hopefully be sworn in next week. Now, this was a lengthy process that began all the way back in December, so district leaders are excited to finally be finishing the process. Please say aye. 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 All it took was one motion. To move forward in conducting additional background checks and contract negotiations. And get that much closer to a new district leader. Meet Dr. Jamal Wright. First of all, I'm excited to be here. The Little Rock School Board's final pick for superintendent. Tuesday night, it came down to two candidates, right up against Dr. Gregory Thomas of Virginia, with the weight of a district on their shoulders. I have no interest in, and I hope you don't either, with getting a new superintendent to make sure we do anything less than go for world class. Board members think they made the right choice. To a person like me, this is the perfect opportunity for me. Last week, Wright pitched himself to parents and teachers, citing his achievements from his first job as an educator. Born and raised and lived most of my life in Jacksonville, Florida. To turning around school districts in Denver and D.C. I really learned how important and valuable it was to utilize teachers in any uh, school improvement process. Now he's hoping to take his years of experience to the capital city with a focus on equity and leadership for every student. We've got to create a culture within our district and within our schools to where every student feels they have a connection with somebody. Now, the school board says that they hope to get Dr. Wright finalized next week during a special school board meeting, so that way he's all set to replace the current superintendent, Mike Poor, at the end of this school year. Reporting in front of Little Rock School District, Katrin Asaf, back to you.